Claps, shouts, and tears of joy were on display at the Texas Capitol Monday as the decision to halt Melissa Lucio's execution came down. It's a stage to have a hearing to determine whether there should be a new trial. The decision came from the Court of Criminal Appeals and now will be set for a hearing with a lower court. Lucio was set to be executed on Wednesday. It's really outrageous and frightening and should concern everybody in Texas that it takes getting to this point before you can actually even get anybody to pay attention. This is such a bigger fight, you know, for women who have suffered with addiction, who have children they cannot take care of. And instead of helping this woman, we failed her. Jennifer Toon did time behind bars alongside Lucio at the Mountain View unit in Gatesville. She was among many supporters calling for her immediate release while the case is being reviewed. This is not right. This is not who we are as the state of Texas. These are not our values. And Melissa deserves a, a fair trial. Lucio was convicted in 2008 of beating her two-year-old daughter Mariah to death. She claims the toddler fell down the stairs, and she also says she was coerced into a false confession. It's the fact that the doctor who treated Mariah and declared her dead in the emergency room is not the doc doctor who testified as such at her trial. That The actual doctor that declared her dead and examined her said in one of these, de uh, these declarations in the appeals that he saw no evidence of child abuse. Supporters say political corruption on behalf of the DA at the time, Armando Villalobos, the new evidence, and the alleged coerced confession should all exonerate her. I'm happy to see a glimmer of hope from Texas. I cannot believe that it took this to do the right thing.